Hi everyone! Hey. It's Facebook Live time. Woo. We are here to do a demo on a talk Luma Spot accent. Wow, I really, <laughs> really excited. We've got our lovely victim. I mean, volunteer. Hello, Kayla Barber. <laughs> so we are all here, all ready to show you the tips, the tricks, the things you really want to know to get the best results with a demo. I've got everything here that I want for when I'm doing a demo. I want to start with cleansing, so I've got this. Then I want to move to accent with my ideal eyes. You need to moisten the skin when you cleanse, so I've got my little Lumispa spray bottle. Just a little tip. So, um, normally I would cleanse, I would start and cleanse. Um, just half the face. This is really tip number one, probably the most important tip of all of them. You only ever want to treat half the face. I know that they want to feel like their whole face is refreshed and they want the benefits to the whole face. But the thing is, is after you're done with a demo, the whole rest of the day, it's just going to cement home how powerful the difference between the two sides of their face feel. So this side's gonna feel so much smoother and they're gonna notice it over and over throughout the day. So only half the face and tip number two start with this cleansing step because this step is so um, incredibly amazing at exfoliating off the upper layers of skin treating the skin exciting the skin you know getting the skin going so we can promote that um, volume and density long term but you just get your immediate results with doing this are the smoothness and the brightness to the skin so start with this so that we can get the maximum results and then you want to take this head off and if you just wiggle like this and pull it will come right off and then you switch to your accent tip now with the accent there's this notch right here oh, okay. and on the device there's this notch right here yeah. mm -hmm. so you line those two notches up and you just kind of wiggle and tug and it snaps right in so you cool. Heard that little wiggle and tug, snaps right off, snaps right in. That's a good tip. So, line those up. <laughs> once you have that, you get your product, you come over here to your lovely volunteer. To your victim. Mm -hmm. I mean your volunteer. <laughs> we all the device. Yes. And I am just going to take, oh, about less than a pea size and put it on my finger. About like that. And then I'm going to just gently dab I mean, technically, I should use my ring finger because it has the fewest muscles of all the fingers. So it's the most gentle. But we're just going to just gently do this. And right over the eye, the eyebrow, right? Yep. yep. Okay. And then <laughs> you turn on the device. And it's the same steps as when you cleanse. So, you know, when you cleanse, you push this button, it turns it on, it'll go for 30 seconds, and you get that little pause, that haptic feedback that tells you your first 30 seconds are done. And if it was on the face, you'd move to the next area and you have four, um, four 30 second increments. So we're just gonna use the first for 30 seconds, unless I get really excited and do it for 60 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> so we just push the button and then you can see the head has started to move. And then um, on your volunteer, on Kayla, normally when you're doing it on yourself, circular motions like this are fine, but when I'm doing a demo, I go back to more of the galvanic spa movements. Nice and slow, coming up around the eye, pausing in the crow's feet area, and then lifting up underneath the brow right here. You can see me going all the way underneath that brow and lifting. I was pressing too hard, so it told me to lighten up. <laughs> and then I'm going to start over again. Nice and slow. You can see me getting close to the eye, but not so close that I'm actually getting the product in her eye. Lifting and pausing there, and then coming up underneath this brow, getting some more lifting action here. And what this is going to do is it's going to give us those benefits that we want to see with smoothing the skin, brightening the skin, and lifting. I don't know why I'm touching your shoulder. <laughs> Not a necessary part of the demo. <laughs> I'm going to go just a little lower right here. 
If she had any bags, I'd be working on that area right there, but she doesn't. She's a beautiful millennial. So it's been 30 seconds. I'm just gonna go for 30 more because I'm having a lot of fun. Mm. So normally you've only do 30, 30 seconds. Just in case somebody has sensitive skin, you don't wanna aggravate it too much. But I know that Kayla doesn't have sensitive skin. We've done demos with her before. So I'm just gonna get a little extra boost working the rest of this product in. Now, and we're done. <laughs> so after you've done that, you take any excess product and just gently massage that in. And we're gonna follow the same motion, just upward and lifting. And just massage in any excess product. And then, oh my goodness. Wow. Holy wow. Is it crazy? <laughs> that is awesome. <laughs> Can you like screenshot while we're doing a Facebook Live? Uh, I need to save well, that. I don't think so. <laughs> oh, okay. we'll Alexa's Alexa's got it. Oh, get Alexa's going to do one. Okay. <laughs> Go even closer. Get in, get in there. Yeah. Like awkward close. <laughs> <laughs> Awkward clothes. That is cool. So in that's the power space. of a, a one-time demo. In 30 seconds, well, we did 60 seconds, you can see already a lifting. Now, it's not going to be over-the-top dramatic, but you could clearly see on Kayla, who's a young millennial, um, results. You could see the brightening. You could see the lifting. Um, there's a... And... Yeah, I forgot what else I was going to say. <laughs> or something else. <laughs> I don't know. But it was so easy. Yeah. I mean, we just put a little on, push a button, and then upward, outward movements with a lifting motion always coming up underneath the eyebrow right, right here. So, are we ready to switch and, and do it with Eric yes. now? I'm not All a right. millennial, though. I'm not as pretty as, as, as Kayla, uh, but... Don't tell yourself, <laughs> Now, normally, I would use some hand sanitizer and um, cleanse this device, so I would be ready for my next demo. Um, but I came prepared because I knew that I was going to have two demos. So I've got my second unit here. I'm going to just snap on the new head um, accent device. And then we'll come back over to Eric. I'll let you hold this, please. And I'm just going to do the same thing. Now with Kayla, you saw how much I used on my finger. I wished I had had a little bit more because I didn't end up with a lot to massage in afterwards. So I'm using more on Eric this time. I have a fatter head too, so <laughs> probably need a little bit more. <laughs> I'm gonna get even just a teeny bit more. Am I too tall? No, nope. yeah, okay. you're okay. I just teeny, teeny, teeny bit more. Okay, let me put this down. You need like some music or something. Uh, and I just rubbed <laughs> the excess on my finger into my hand because I'm not wasting any of this good stuff. <laughs> so again, I'm just gonna push, push this button once. You can see the head has started to move and we're ready to go. So again, I'm just gonna start right here in the inner corner of the eye and slowly work my way around the eye. Not pushing too hard because this is a very delicate, sensitive area, but again, nice and slow. So you're getting, if you move too fast, you're not giving the unit a chance to work. And I'm gonna lift here underneath the brow area. We want that nice lifting motion. I was pressing a little too hard. That's why you got that haptic feedback. This can be nice and gentle. Again, slow around the eye. Yeah, for a minute there, I was wondering what was hapticing. <laughs> haptic <-ing>. Oh, no. <laughs> Eric, is, Eric is famous <laughs> in our department for dad jokes. <laughs> hey, I've got kids. i got to entertain them somehow. <laughs> So you can see how close, if you can come in, um, Alexa, you can see how close I'm getting to the eye, but again, I'm not so close to the eye that I'm actually at risk of getting the product into his eye. 
Because even an eyelash in your eye area is going to be irritating. It certainly feels good. It does, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Everyone loves being pampered. Mm -hmm. That was 30 seconds. We're going to do 60 seconds on air, too. I probably need a good hour. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> So a couple of people have asked if you should put the ideal eyes on dry or should we moisten the face first? There's no, good question, no need to moisten the face, you can put it on dry. Now if you've done a cleansing treatment first, the skin will be slightly damp as you um, wash off the cleanser, but that's okay if it's slightly damp. But no need to um, wet the face down. Okay, so we're just gonna take this excess and just massage that in and then following those same upward, outward motions. Pausing again and then coming up. And just massaging this in. Don't sleep I, I know. <laughs> I'm I'm lifted fall his asleep. eye open. I'm like, hey. <laughs> We've almost worked the rest of it in. Just a couple more times around here. And again, we're always just emphasizing that upward, outward with a slight pause. That slight pause just seems to make a world of difference. And with this device, you, the motion that it's using, that circular motion, is literally, we've done clinical studies to determine the right frequency, to make sure it's at the right frequency to activate the skin to um, get the lifting motion, to get the brightening that we want to see there. So let's take a look. And once again, you can see some oh, really nice results. Isn't that awesome? Open your eyes. <laughs> but not creepy. Oh, oh not at all. Okay. <laughs> but no smiling. This oh, no smile. Yeah. Yeah, that is so exciting. Okay, can you take a picture of this yes. one? So you can see how easy this is. Uh, we'll switch spots. <laughs> you can see how easy that is. It just takes 30 seconds. Um, I did both of mine for 60 because I get a little gung-ho. But again, make sure they don't have sensitive skin if you're going to do that. Also, if you're combining it with cleansing half the face, which I didn't do in this scenario, I kind of wish we would have because we would have gotten even more dramatic results with these two. If you're combining it with the cleansing, you, you uh, probably don't need to double up and we don't recommend doubling up. So you will have already treated for 30 seconds cleansing, and then you'll have another 30 seconds following up with applying the Idealize. So you'll be perfect at that. And then just make sure you have the tools you need with you. You have your device, you have everything laid out in case you should need it, and you are going to experience success. And no matter what they say, do not go back and treat the other half so that the whole rest of the day, they're just like, oh my gosh, I have to, it just emphasizes the results that they're seeing so that they have a deeper belief because the more they believe in it, the more that they're gonna consistently use it every day. And that's where the most amazing results come. If you consistently use it 30 to 90 days, you're really seeing the maximum results with brightening, lifting, and um, I emphasize that the short-term benefits were the lifting and the um, brightening. The long-term benefits are the dark circles, the puffiness, and the under-eye bags in the eye area. So those are your long-term benefits that you're going to see. So uh, we can't wait to see your success, everyone. Good luck with your demos. Share them with us. Bye. See ya. Bye-bye.